All right. We lived on Temple Street. And then uh, Rosemont was right across the street. That was the elementary where we, uh, I went to. Danny and Frankie and me went to that elementary school. And um, it was right across the street. We never lived far from where we went to school. So it wasn't like some horrible thing where we had to get on the bus. Um, Rosemont. Evangelina and Johnny started kindergarten there. When when we moved there, I was already maybe in second, third grade. That's where um, Mrs. Pfefferman was my favorite teacher. Mrs. Pfefferman found out that I needed glasses. I remember in her class, all of a sudden I couldn't see the board anymore. So I would be writing the stuff and then she said, you, you probably need glasses. So mom took me to it was the PTA um, clinic for glasses. So we got some really reduced price on glasses. And that's where I started wearing glasses. But Rosemont. Oh gosh, Rosemont. Hmm. We used to go Wednesdays, I think. Some during the week, one day during the week. Simon, this black guy, really nice black guy would come in his Volkswagen bus. Simon only had like two fingers and these were all gone, no thumbs. And his feet were the same thing. And um, Simon, we would ask him, how come you got that like that? He said he was in an accident when he was a, a little kid. We don't know if that was true. I think he was born like that. But Simon would take us to the YMCA in downtown Los Angeles, which was close by. We would get in his bus and his Volkswagen bus and go to the YMCA and go to the pool and do exercises and stuff like that. That's where I was, I remember, I told Frank, I asked Frank if he remembers, he doesn't remember. There was all these black guys in the pool naked way over that side. A bunch of black guys, and all together. I don't know, I think there was some gay shit going on there. But, you know, we were over here, a bunch of kids, you know, swimming and stuff, and then we'd get out the pool and go do exercise and then Simon would take us back. We went a bunch of times. Um, one day Simon says, yeah Simon says, Simon tells us um, Saturday, kind of get dressed up, don't come in jeans or anything, kind of, you know, look like you're presentable and a bus is going to come and, and they're going to take you and you're going to do something. We didn't know what was going on but uh, Simon was cool. And Simon said to do this, so we, me and Frank got dressed up and waited there in front of the school. Sure enough, this big bus, it said Warner Brothers on the back. We didn't know where we were going or what we were doing. And there was other kids in the bus, and I think the bus stopped somewhere else. And we went to the Cinerama Dome in Hollywood, I think it's Sunset or Hollywood Boulevard, I forget where it's at. Cinerama Dome, huge place. It looked like a um, a golf ball, half golf ball, big dome thing. So we go there. It's a movie theater. We're sitting there, you know, we're going to see a movie. A mad, 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 mad world, the premiere. Super great movie. We saw that movie. To this day, I bought the DVD, Blu-ray. I have it there, and, and it's on TV, too. Wonderful movie, comedy, you know, all kinds of comics in that movie, comedians. Wonderful, we saw that there. Then, I think it was a, a intermission, we went back to the bus and we had a, a, a cold chicken lunch with some other things in it and presents. I think it was around Christmas. I remember a puzzle and some other things I got. They were all on the seats when we got back. That was great. I still love that. That was a great memory. A mad, 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 mad world. Simon. Simon one time took us to, I don't know if it was Big Bear or where it was up in the mountains, um, for a weekend. Us and some other kids, some other black kids, we went up to this big cabin, huge cabin, and um, it was cold. And um, we stayed in the cabin. It was like the weekend. And then we went... Uh, sledding, he had a sled that fell apart. There wasn't much snow, but, snow, but there was snow. And took us to where this 
pool was that we couldn't go in the pool because it was all covered and stuff but it was just and we could look out over and see way down there and see farmland you know the checkerboard um farmland way down there that was nice simon was a good guy after that i never heard of simon again rosemont mm, i graduated from rosemont Yes, went to Virgil. Virgil's a whole other story.